Hi oh, guys. So this is your clueless fucking moron. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Back in the goddamn shithole of South Austin, Texas. I have been for five days. I've been out there in paradise in, uh, in Tillman, Texas at the Old Settlers Music Festival playing music with my cl clueless lovable friends out there in the woods and uh, so I come back to Austin, Texas like a goddamn fool you know because I my truck my my dangerous uh, death trap gas truck and gas truck and suck that I've had uh, parked out on the side of the road here in South Austin for five days you know I can't drive it anymore because the steering could go out on any minute so anyway I went out there with a friend and uh, her car and so of course we had to stop in Garfield which is on the way back from the uh, folk festival so we, we stop off in goddamn Garfield well it's not on the way it's a half hour out of the way to unload some shit out of her van to uh, into my barn some of that planet eating shit that I've had out at the folk festival with me we stop for five minutes I tell her darling I just need to throw this shit in the barn we need to stop for five minutes in Garfield Texas we both have a shitload to do so anyway, I have been on my, by the way, did I say it is Monday, April 14th, 2019, as this nightmare of selling and buying a new truck continues. So we saw it for five fucking minutes to pull a few things out of, out of her van. Well, of course, for five days, uh, we have been away from flush toilets. We have not seen a flush toilet in five days and uh, so you probably know where this story is going so I wasn't even planning to open the back door of my house I I open the guy I, I get my keys out of her van take them out of the van open the back door of the house so we can use the modern convenience of a flush toilet before heading back to Austin Texas I get back in this gas sucking van, we drive to Austin, we unload the whole goddamn van, and then I get on my computer because I've been telling people on Craigslist that I would be back. At 2 o'clock Monday afternoon, I was going to be back for people who wanted to test drive my truck. So that was what I was planning to do, was to have people come and test drive my fucking truck in Austin, Texas. So I have people coming over, you know, to, to test drive the truck, and then I have the woman next door bitching that I have parked my old truck for weeks. That was her term. The the lady next door saying you've had that that old truck out there for weeks, and to move that truck before she reports me to the cops and uh, so I call her back as politely as I could I said lady actually I've had that truck out there for five days and it's about four feet sticking over your property line I said but don't worry I'll go move the truck thank you so much for understanding so you know where the story is going. I reach in my pocket to get the keys to move the truck. The truck key that I need to, uh, the truck key I need to let these people test drive the truck. Where do you think my keys are? My keys are stuck in the doorknob of my house in Garfield. The door is not only unlocked, the, uh, the door is wide open. 
the door is wide open uh, in Garfield and let me tell you Garfield Texas is a little bit more of a crime a high crime district than South Austin so here I am in fucking bumper to bumper traffic it's 3.30 in the fucking afternoon. 3.30 in the fucking afternoon. I, it's probably going to take me a goddamn hour and a half uh, to get to fucking Garfield, Texas, so I can get my fucking key to move this fucking truck and, and, and let people come drive it. You know, five days I have of, of R&R &R I, I am I am back in, in, in this goddamn brain-eating fucking matrix. Uh, I, I, I've been back. I, I, I'm not back for one fucking hour before all of this fucking bullshit. And, and look at me now, driving all over the state of Texas, stuck in bumper to bumper fucking traffic to get a goddamn key trying to sell a fucking truck. And so it's now Monday afternoon, so it looks like Wednesday morning. What I am doing is I am getting on an airplane. I am flying to Orlando, Florida, renting a car, going driving around the state of Florida try to find a fucking used pickup truck. And so then some, some woman selling her truck in Florida. Well, Sam, so, uh, you know, I'm going to be taking the, the tags off of this truck. You know, in Florida, the tags stay with the owner, not with the vehicle. So I don't know how you're driving back to Texas with no license plate. Uh, this bullshit never fucking ends. There is no end to this nightmare. I took a five day vacation from this goddamn nightmare. I come back within one hour. Uh, here is my goddamn life. And I have not even been in the fucking Doomosphere. Five glorious days outside of both the Doomosphere and more importantly, the fucking Matrix just been out of this shit and, and back in it and, you know the, the, this bullshit is this is what eats our fucking lives people you, you know is 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 Jesus fucking Christ when am I gonna get the goddamn message fuck Look at this bullshit. You, know, you ought to come back in an hour and a half when it really is rush hour traffic. You, you, you know, guys, this is one highway leading out of one town in, in, in the United States of America in the year 2019. And, uh, and it's not even fucking rush hour. We are completely totally fucked. This is this goddamn intersection, you know, out by the, uh, out by the airport out here, uh, east of Austin. Uh, it, it's been under, I, I, I'm pretty sure they have been working on this, uh, this thing for seven years for, to build this, uh, newest clover leaf from hell, uh, out here. Uh, on the way to the airport, I think it's at least seven years, and and I think the Un the United Nations is suggesting we have 12 years to wean ourselves off of fossil fuels when they cannot build one highway uh, interchange 
uh, in seven years in the state of Texas that the fucking traffic jam, this one road construction project has caused over seven years, had j just the CO2 emissions from the people stuck in this road construction from hell for seven fucking years have probably put more carbon dioxide into this planet's atmosphere uh, than the country of Ghana has put into the fucking atmosphere uh, since they started building this goddamn thing. Look at this fucking thing. And and it's just heading right this way. I mean, you know, look, look at all the, uh, the the goddamn lane. Look, look at all of this shit, guys. It's taken them seven years to get to this fucking point. Jesus fucking Christ, we're so fucking fucked. Look at this shit, you know, and it and it's this way from uh, now. Now I'm getting ready to dr make another fucking drive back uh, from the shithole state of Florida, going through all of this shit, and packing up my brand new gas sucking truck and heading to heading to New York, baby. I will be in upstate New York on I'm leaving, getting the hell out of this shithole on May 13th. Not a fucking day too soon. Jesus, look at this fucking mess. What the fuck is this down here? What the fuck is this? Look at this guy. It looks like something out of some goddamn third world country. That's exactly what the fuck he is. Is some schmuck in some goddamn third world fucking country. Jesus. Where the fuck to Garfield, Texas? I mean, back in Garfield, Texas for two minutes. Maybe I'll raid my garden while I'm out there, see if there's any damn snow peas that didn't get fucking incinerated while I was out there and uh, playing music with my clueless lovable friends. We're fucked. Uh, then I get to get back and uh, I guess I guess it's time to dive into the Doomosphere. I, all I had time to do was you know, look at my email and it looks like Chris Hedges, what is the title of Chris Hedges' rant uh, this week? I think it's time to say goodbye to planet Earth. So, uh, along with probably everyone else in the Doomosphere tonight, but I'm going to put that over there at Collapse Chronicles. Uh, so if you want to uh, hear Chris Hedges' eulogy to the late great planet Earth, uh, you'll have to come over to Collapse Chronicles, but that's going to be a couple of fucking hours because I got to drive to Garfield, Texas and pick up this goddamn key, come move my fucking truck before it gets towed off and hopefully sell this piece of shit and get ready to get on a goddamn airplane to Florida on Wednesday morning, so I guess I will be back in the Doomosphere for one day tomorrow, and then I will disappear again for several days off to Florida to buy a fucking gas-sucking truck because I just don't get it yet. Jesus fucking Christ. I'm so sick and tired of my goddamn life. Bye, guys.